being a little bit late. We wanted to hang out and uh, wait for any last minute stragglers that were coming to see the show. I'd like to welcome everyone out to Eric's Bike Shop today. This is the Harl Freestyle team you're going to see riding and uh, with me today. We've got a couple of the hottest riders in the nation. And uh, if you guys would please put your hands together and welcome my first rider, 19 year old Ronnie Wilton. Ronnie, come on out here. Ronnie here is uh, from Spring Valley, California. He's by San Diego. He's been on my team now for about three years. Uh, Ronnie is primarily a freestyle rider. You're going to notice when he rides, he's exceptionally good on the ground tricks, on the ramp tricks. Uh, his aerials are looking a lot better this summer tour. He's been with me, like I said, three years. This is his second summer tour with me. And uh, he competed recently in a contest in Venice Beach, California. And he placed third in the pro class, which he did quite well in. Uh, freestyle BMX is fairly new. I'm sure a lot of the kids here went to the show yesterday. We had some, I want to recap on some of the things. But for the people that didn't see it, Freestyle BMX is fairly new. It's been around seven years since it's been started. But in the uh, professional and competition sense, it's only been this last year. And so Rich and Ron have recently competed in this contest. Like I said, Ronnie did third in the pro class, which was for money. And uh, we also competed in another contest coming up in uh, September. So hopefully that one is for $5,000. So hopefully you come away with some money out of that one. All right, that's Ronnie Wilton. My next rider, please welcome him out, is 17-year-old uh, Rich Sevier. Spider-Man, as he likes to be called. Richie is uh, kind of a Gumby on his bicycle when he does his aerials and things like that. He, uh, like I said to Ron, is a freestyle rider. Richie is also, but in, Richie is in a different sense. Richie is more of a skate park rider. He has a lot of uh, hot ramp tricks, aerial routines, and things like that. So when we go later in the show, you're going to see Richie pumping off some really high airs and taking his hands and feet off, at least one hand and one foot, crossing it up. He gets pretty wild when it comes to that. Rich also competed in the contest in Venice Beach, California. He placed first in a 17 and over class, which he did quite well in. And I think when you see him ride, he is also quite good at what he does. My name is Bob Harlow, and I'm not going to be riding for you guys today. I um, screwed up my knee. I guess that's not a good term there, but I messed up my knee. I was practicing, I tore some ligaments, and uh, so anyway, I brought my team out with me, so they're going to be doing all the showing off today. But I don't think you'll be disappointed. The guys will do a really good job for you today. This is our uh, fifth week of a six-week tour, and we've been traveling throughout the United States doing shows. We've put on about 10,000 miles on our van since we left. We bought a new van, and we had three miles when we left. So we put on about 10,000 miles doing shows and stuff throughout the United States. And uh, we have three more. We go home, and I think, oh, Ronnie's telling me two more now. The guys are counting it. Everybody's getting a little bit anxious to get home and sleep in their own beds and stuff like that. So. I still think they're going to do a good job today. If you guys are up for a good show, they'll do their best for you. You've got nice weather. Uh, a little bit about the equipment the guys are riding. Ronnie is on our Master Freestyle bike. This is the one right here for the kids that don't know what it is. And Rich is on our Sport Freestyle bike. These bikes are made specifically for this kind of riding. It's for trick riding or freestyle riding. The bikes are made a little bit more heavy duty. They're not just your regular department store wonder bikes. The bikes are set up, you can tell, with uh, things like mag wheels, the uh, plastic wheels, which work really well for the ground and ramp tricks, which take a lot of abuse. Some of the other things the guys do, Ronnie, uh, both Ron and Rich have front and rear handbrakes on. Ronnie will show you one of the reasons why. Taking a bike up into a pogo like this, it works really well, just locking up the front brake, balancing, and then the same with the back wheel. Another thing we do, we run a coaster brake. Ronnie will show you why here. Now this works really good as you can roll up and back. Coaster brake is like your old uh, paper bike style one. And uh, instead of a freewheel, which a 10 speed has, this enables the guys to roll forward or backwards on the ramps. So also some of the tricks they go through, it works really well. Uh, some of the other things we do. Uh, we run a street style tire, mainly one of the reasons is we ride always on a pavement surface. It works really well. It's uh, just better traction and stuff like that. Grip tape on the top tubes. This was for some of the tricks that Ron and Rich do where they put their feet up on top. Keeps their feet from slipping off. Other than that, we just like to tell the kids to come out to watch our shows. Uh, this is, it's not necessarily dangerous, but it's, it's a lot of fun and I'm sure you're going to do it, but just wear your protective gear. These guys have been doing it for some time, so you know they know what they're doing. So if you're going to practice this kind of stuff, at least wear a good helmet and some protective gear. Other than that, you guys up for a good show today? You guys yeah! Alright, here we go. 